The greatest challenge of working with adolescents is it's an awkward, awkward dance. I know I am. It is an awkward age. In middle school, we're all going through our own changes and experiences. It's a great opportunity to to enter into that with kids and to be be like, yeah, we'll walk alongside you. It's like a family, almost. We are a high energy, highly energetic, um, joyful learning community. We take learning very seriously, but we don't take ourselves too seriously. Our vision certainly is to be a comprehensive, cutting edge neighborhood middle school. Our primary mission, our primary goal is to build sturdy human beings. So you're able to make the connection? I think a lot of it has to do with the connections that our staff has with us. They're there to, I don't know like how to say, like have fun with you almost, but learn at the same time. Our teachers are innovative and they're willing to take risks. Watch your notes, please. It's a relatively inexpensive time of life to make mistakes. So we talk a lot about the gift of struggle, and we try to practice it regularly. It's struggle. We were uh, very excited this morning to be able to bring in uh, former Denver Broncos head coach Mike Shanahan. People are always going to look at your size. They're going to look at your height. Uh, certainly no stranger to adversity. For him to be able to talk to our students about that experience was uh, really powerful. At Crest Hill, we're all about teaching you how to think through and in and under and around. Comparing wind energy to solar energy. Of our tech lab, uh, which is really a discovery, uh, inquiry-driven experience, is uh, really state-of-the-art. Some of the, the top, the, the newest, best equipment available for our kids to play with. We kind of decided to make a hockey video. We've got kids working and designing apps. Uh, because that was something they wanted to explore and investigate. A lot of video production, a lot of uh, uh, audio um, producing and, and mixing and recording. It's um, a place of opportunity. 79% of our students' body is involved in one or more of our uh, athletic or activities after school. From the web program to theater to sports. I'm involved in sports and athletics as well as um, honors academics. Well, okay, you hold that one. I try to get involved in anything and everything because it helps connect, make more friends, it helps connect with the staff that leads it, and then overall it just like makes better connections and makes school easier. I stay very busy. <laughs> We do a musical each year and we do a uh, straight uh, play in the fall. It's a neat opportunity to see kids grow into who they are, and become a little bit more mature along the way. I think they have a confidence in doing those things because they've been able to stumble a little bit, they've been able to you know, learn through it. Kids that come out of Crest Hill are extremely well uh, prepared for high school. Show me X and Y. Not only are we learning foundational steps in our uh, education that will help us greatly in, um, in our lives moving forward, but also it's where you learn your morals and your ethics and work ethics that will travel with you for life. I really hope that we send kids out feeling like I've got, I've got the good tools. At the end of the day, that's what we do. We build sturdy people for a very complex and shifting world. I love hearing kids who come back and visit and go, I really miss middle school.